Hi, I'm Aiden Ullier. I'm London Gray. I spend my time working with kids in dressage. It started as a show, a competition. That show has had as many as 325 competitors at a time. Um, and as I say, that's 20 years of that. And our sort of our other major program now is the uh, TEAM program, which stands for Training, Education, and Mentoring. And we have at this moment almost a little over 350 kids in that from all over the country. Why did you start this program? How did it all come about? I was very active in Pony Club. And Pony Club is, has so much of an emphasis, not just on the riding, but on the horse care and the knowledge and all of that. And as I took riders, particularly to our North American championships, I was seeing, and I was part of it, where you had a, a kid get a horse and you taught that kid to ride that horse in that test. And so many of them weren't even taking care of their own horses. So I wanted to see more education brought in. And then everything else was kind of filling in the blanks. We started pony clinics because we have so few pony riders pony. in this country. Yeah. And then we started the team clinics because we, you know, we were looking to bring kids up from the very lowest levels and to bring in kids from parts of the country that don't have much dressage and try to bring some education to them. Yeah. I remember I got a scholarship to go uh, over to Europe and train. That's right, when you and went. And that was amazingly helpful. Yeah. Going and taking a ho just one horse over to Europe is such an expense. Exactly. And not just exactly. paying for your horse in and you're paying for the grain over there and yeah. you're paying for your hotel bills and eating out most of the time because you're not going to be staying in a place right. where there's a kitchen. That's right. So having lots of schnitzel. <laughs> and so it's great to be able to help the kid, you know, when he's she's seven, eight years old and then following through to helping those to get their judge's card or helping those to get instructor certification or go to the Olympics, whatever direction they might be going in. Just to brag a little, the one we're, we're proudest of is Laura Graves. I mean, now one of the top riders in the world who got her introduction to dressage in our first youth dressage festival. But if you ask what I'm proudest of, I'm proudest of bringing these kids up 